Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to demonstrate a direct chop technique in a white intumescent cataract. So we've made our side port incision and now we're staining the anterior capsule with an air bubble by gently massaging it all over the anterior lens capsule. Our patient has been given IV mannitol preoperatively to shrink the vitreous body. So as we are deepening the anterior chamber with a cohesive viscoelastic, we notice that the convexity of the anterior capsule is reversed and it's become flat and almost concave. Nevertheless, the capsular axis is a very important step in an intumescent cataract and it has to be done very carefully. So we've managed to complete an adequate capsular axis about 5 to 5.5 millimeters and we're going ahead with the direct chop technique for the nuclear fractures. This is a dense cataract that has some leathery components so as demonstrated in my previous videos we're going ahead with the multi-planar chopping technique. As you can see that we have to initiate the chop in a superficial plane and then go again deeper to achieve complete separation of the nuclear fragments. This is the multi-planar chopping technique. So phacom emulsification goes ahead routinely and very little or to no cortical fibers are there in the capsular bag. demonstrating the hydro implantation of a hydrophilic single piece IOL. So this concludes the case. Thanks for watching.